Movement number four. Dragon seeks path. Dragon whips his tail. Yo, my man, why you got on that purse, huh? Hey, you seen the no purse? I'm the big dilf. Don't do that. I'm not out of Patron in a bit at you, heard? Get your money up, not your funny up. See nothing wrong. I don't want to hurt nobody. With a little muffled podcast. I don't see With a nothing. We out here, boy. We lit. Get your money up, not your funny up, dummy. Yo, a whole lot of gang ish, you know what I'm saying? We got that that mother effing script project coming soon. We got that strictly for the fans merchandise is out now. Link is in the description. We got the new Munfu Gunfu podcast coming oh, by through. By the way, last time we said it was coming on the second, uh, it might not be coming on the second. We'll let y'all know. We'll keep you posted. Yeah. Then you got the Dax feature coming soon, Mad Fire. Yeah. Then you got all that stuff coming soon, Strictly for the Fans merch out now. Link in the description. Make sure you cop that. Make sure you go cop yeah. that Strictly for the Fans album. It's out on iTunes, Spotify, whatever you indulge in. You dig what I'm saying? And then today, we gonna run it back because y'all apparently wanted to see that Lazy bone, crazy bone, 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 well, bone, bone, stuff. Yesterday we did the reaction as the Mom Food Podcast to the lazy bone diss. Uh, I enjoyed that a lot. Seems like y'all did too. It's doing pretty good numbers. Um, we shoot for like, I shoot for two to 3,000 views an episode. Um, right. If it's not something like brand new, something just, yeah, just, yeah. You know, just some chill stuff. Yeah, yeah. So, um, this morning, Lazy Bone dropped this video. I don't know if it was this morning, but that's when I saw it. Talking about, um, he want to squad up. He with the squabbles. Man, he trying to squab it. Definitely trying so, to squabble. He trying to rumble with that nigga 21. So, we going to do another reaction, since y'all like it. Uh, we gonna just let Lazy Bone talk, and we you gonna get the monthful breakdown of that shit. We're <coughs> Facto, let's get into it. You know what I mean? So I know hold niggas. Because this is a long ass video, so let's Facts. do right. It's like, like motherfucking Eminem and and motherfuckers like Lil Wayne pause, and pause, all pause, them pause, niggas pause, gotta. Pause. Is that where it starts? You know how, like, when people record it from Instagram, they're obviously not going to get how the first the couple seconds. 21 minutes and some change. 21 and what change? How much change? 54? 21, 54, yeah. That's weird. All right, go ahead. Feel right. a, a verbal combat war. That's what this rap shit is. Who the wittiest? Who the smartest? You know what I mean? I know niggas well, like, like motherfuckers. Why that nigga look like a confused chihuahua? <laughs> this nigga got a Kango hat on. Definitely got an LL Cool J Samuel. Fucking <laughs> Eminem and, and motherfuckers like Lil Wayne and all them niggas gotta feel where I'm coming from, my nigga, because them niggas is fucking masters at it. Why does he look so like... You know what really? I mean? Them niggas like, is really like good at their wordplay. They had to develop over years and years of hard work. It's how many lot. songs, how many albums? Albums. You feel me? Like, come on, man. Keep it 100. Like, but you, that nigga's young. That's cool. But don't think for a fucking second, man, I'm going to slow down or I'm going to be scared. You look scared a little bit. I had some fallouts scared. with niggas back in the days in this rap game that I, we all friends now. We could all be dead motherfuckers. Do or die, no man. Shit, we tore up some hotels one motherfucker time. Thank That's God it didn't go that far. Pause it, pause it. Let me, let, me, let, me, let me say what's real for a second. Because busy 100% right though. Lazy, my bad. Let's not forget that these were the Migos. 
these were the because <coughs> you know how people love to rewrite history. Yeah, facts. And act like they were De La Soul. Nah, nigga. There was pistol toting. Yeah, facts. niggas thought that they were gangsters. There's niggas who were afraid of these niggas. These niggas were not like I know. It's so weird how time works that. After a while, everybody became is is from that era is now like a like like not who they were. These were gangster rappers. Facts. These were not like they I were the goons. They were the street about, niggas. They're definitely way more street than the Migos. We're not even gonna play that. We're definitely not gonna play that. I don't they're know about all that, but they're definitely they're definitely. Yo, the Migos, we're not going to do that because the Migos are definitely some goon. They definitely beat every nigga up Bro, in their if way. if there was as much cameras around now then as there is now, you, them, dog, Bone Thugs and them was beefing with a lot of people. They was beefing with Twister, Do or Die. And this wasn't no beef. This was guns was getting pulled out. There's stories yeah. where niggas got guns drawn on them. Yeah, that's This ain't right. no, that's 90s beef. Nah, man. We ain't gonna do that because we see videos of them fighting. Because we saw videos of Migos fighting. You know what kind of stories I've heard of Bone Thugs? They be wildin'. I mean, I, I mean they all be wildin'. Them all them niggas be wildin'. Nah, them niggas was... Them Bone Thug, young Bone Thugs was off the chin -ain. I mean, if you smoke... If you're willing to smoke crack, you're definitely willing to bust a gun. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, I'm not gonna, like... Like, if I... I just call a spade a spade. <laughs> like, you gonna hit that rock. Like, you obviously gonna be a pistol toe nigga. Like, you clearly not scared of jail or anything else. All I'm saying is I don't want to see nobody pretending like these niggas was not... Because age, age is gonna happen to everybody. And I'm sure when age happens, Migos are gonna be looked at like... EPMD, I'm sure, in, in time, they're gonna be looked at like EPMD. Yeah, correct, though. But... Yeah, these are definitely like if there was ever a thing called mumble rap or so. That's why I said like, that's why I said it'd be a good a good thing. A lot of people were like, you thought there'd be a good battle. Yeah, I'm just saying maybe I was thinking of Young Bone Thugs versus them because yeah. they're like, there was a time of people like I don't know what they're saying, but it just sounds good. good yeah, yeah, niggas definitely they were the, didn't like, know. like originators of that. They're fan, of, fan, of, fan of. That's like niggas still like don't mumble. know what Crossroads says, exactly. and I'm gonna miss everybody. And we pray, we pray. I'm about to play. Thank God we had <clears throat> overseers like, like Lil J from Rap a Lot told me to sit my stupid ass down and all that type of shit, man. Is that Jay Prince? Yeah. Because you gotta, we gotta have respect somewhere. He probably grew up. So with how about we implement some rules in the game? No flagrant fouls, no this, no that. Meet up in the arena. You know what I mean? Them niggas that do the battle raps and shit like niggas like Cassidy and all them other niggas, pause, they be pause, in each pause. other. Oh. No, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not going to kill him yet. I'm not going to kill him yet. Actually, press play, press play. Give him, give him five more seconds. The then face talking real greasy to a nigga. And they don't never, they ain't killing each other. Them niggas pause. getting they... I thought I was going to shoot him some bail. I thought he was going to say somebody else that actually battle rap. Cassidy is not a battle rapper. We're going to say this right now. Cassidy is not a battle rap. Cassidy is a culture vulture. And Cassidy is not Bro, a battle rap. Battle rap is literally... That's why I don't understand. Battle rap is... I, I <coughs> Just as consumed... As weird as it sounds... Why is it that there's nobody who doesn't know about battle rap? What else do you know that's like that, like, everybody knows about battle rap like everybody knows about UFC. Even right. if they don't know, like, they know it's happening. So I'm like, why is battle rap not bigger? I am confused. Because, yeah, he got the Cassidy thing wrong, but the fact that he even knew Cassidy battled and stuff like that <clears throat> is like, so why is battle rap not I'm so, that's a tangent, though. But I'm like, Wait. every, it don't matter if it's Drake. Yeah. It don't matter if it's, Genuine. Yeah. They all know and watch Bad Rap, but I'm like, that's odd. That's so weird. It's like, definitely weird, bro. Definitely mad, mad, mad weird, though. Independently of battle rapping, I do the shit with song. So, like I'm saying, I'm not going to stop the music. Only thing I was mad with Offset about was like, nigga, don't try to bankroll challenge me, my nigga. This ain't with that. I wasn't on that. I want to be the greatest group ever. We can run neck and neck for, for however long. You know what I mean? We can, we can, uh, 
We, we can be LeBron James and Kevin Durant going at it all goddamn day. But out of respect, them niggas ain't going to try to hurt each other. Them niggas respect one another's game. Competition you know, always Did somebody brings say money. Like I was gonna, taught. That was going to happen or something? I want to say he's more talking about with 21 and them. I don't know because I don't. I don't think he's talking about 21 yet because he's straight up. Just, just oh, yeah. He said and they can box or something. So I assume he's talking about like if we're going to do that, then it's at he least going to be. He hasn't said the box thing yet. No, nah, no. I'm just reading the title, but all right. That from selling now laters in school, nigga, when I was shoveling snow, when I was carrying bags from the grocery store, Christmas, Thanksgiving, trying to make a couple dollars to help out. That nigga still doing that. Competition bro, bring you. money. Tell my nigga, yo, man, I bet you when we was selling dope on the block, nigga, okay, everybody got, we got a hundred dollars. We gonna buy a double up. All right? Tell you take this double up, we gonna, we gonna make 200 off of it. It's five of us, so everybody got two rocks apiece. This way back when we was a little fresh in the game. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Now, bring you go double that 20. Got, got two rocks under that tango. Fastest. You know what I mean? Who moving? Who getting the money? That's the, It was all in the good fun and spirit. But this is the thing. This is the thing I don't understand. It's like he doesn't realize what he just said. He's talking about how <clears throat> back in the day they used to get money. They used to split it up amongst their friends and be happy and yada, yada, yada and hustle. But then he's saying on the same sentence, he's literally talking about, man, don't try to play that big bank, take little bank with me. That's not even what I'm on. And then he's talking about like niggas talk about money. And it's like, bro, like th those niggas are your age when you were talking about what you're just talking about right now. Like now they're your yeah, age. Yeah, I think that's the disconnect between old and young people but i blame old people more because young people don't it's that the for some reason young old people forget what it is to be young and young people don't know what it is to be old so that's why I bl like the young people have not got the opportunity to be old yet but it's like <coughs> i don't understand why you don't like you think people are going to like you are not the first generation of older people to tell younger people to chill Th there was a generation telling them to chill, Fact. especially Bone Thugs and Harmony. Big to chill. Big so facts. it's like you didn't chill until you were ready. What makes right. you think that these dudes are going to do any different? Definitely Maybe you're saying you want them to be better than you, but I don't see what makes you think that that's going to happen. I think that's just human nature. Definitely human nature. Competition. When I was growing up, it wasn't the player hated shit that I see now. And I ain't, I'm just, I'm a half a generation behind you niggas. I ain't even a whole generation of what, out, out of this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, niggas was getting it, my nigga. Real friendly comp competition. It's definitely more like a generation in the house. Flies, boy. Motherfucking. d I see what he, I see, I see what, I see what he tried to do there, though. I see what he tried to do there, though. Uh, Try to hit us with the old whopper. Pause that. I, I think what he's trying to say is he's half a generation <coughs> musically. I don't know how he's getting that. Half a generation. Because, okay, DMX and them, that was one generation. Let's even pretend that little My John... My nigga, a half of generation, this nigga was doing songs with Biggie, bro. Yeah, Biggie right, no. died in 96, bro. 97 97 yeah. 97 Pac died in 96 yeah I mean yeah no that was no nah, he's I don't know <laughs> nigga you guys were signed by Easy E I don't know you more like you more like maybe two and a half generation yeah, nigga, definitely my dad's generation is what I'm telling you definitely tripping <laughs> I, I got you though. definitely I almost you. as old as my dad I'm gonna let that cook yeah I'm just saying though so all I'm saying like 21 Savage, okay, you don't like my shit, you think it's whack, you entitled to that. Like I was saying, ain't none of you niggas gonna change my mind, cause I think my shit dope, nigga. Huh? I'm cool with me. I'm alright. I'm not gonna, uh, I don't need you to make me cool. You know what I'm saying? 
Hold on. You thought 21 was going to bump that and be like, this is the hottest shit? Hold like, on. The weird. nigga no that's problem. recording the video is doing screen recording. He just typed a comment and said, that shit was trash, my nigga. <laughs> Yo, son, I hate the internet, bro. If you want to, there's more of that shit coming. Please believe it. <clears throat> like I said, I, everything in that song I said, back to 21 Savage like that. Man, come on, man. <clears throat> you apologize to them A-Rabs. I mean, not the A-Rabs. You apologize to the Jews because they control everything. They got the power to shut your money down. <clears throat> However the case may be. I don't want to judge. Damn, he just took a but shot. Definitely, definitely, like uh, spitting facts with that. Definitely, like definitely, definitely connected. Wife, like, nigga, you don't know me, man. You should have said that in the song. I don't know you, nigga. I'm saying. We can't get money, but that's an apology right there. Like, my nigga, apologize to that. Because if it's one person on earth that I take a bullet for, that I say fuck everything for, is my wife, nigga. Take it how you want to okay. take it. I hope we can resolve this shit peacefully. Oh, because he dissed his wife. If we can't, I will be ready at all times. Yo, uh, but I will say, all don't times. think that, that nigga definitely look like for those serious about, that, like, he ain't got nothing to lose. He obviously so. has nothing. He definitely would. What? He's obviously got nothing to lose, my nigga. Nah, I'm just saying, like, he that nigga. He definitely, he de I mean, 21 is definitely a very reckless nigga too, though. So, I mean, that ain't saying much. Definitely yeah, seen this nigga like, pull guns out multiple times on camera. He definitely is ready. But see, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't underestimate these older niggas, some of these older niggas. Niggas be, be forget. That is the wildest shit because it's like, it kind of is like, or maybe I sound like an old head, but it's like, dog, these people were scaring people back in the day. Oh, like, yeah, they, they definitely uh, were. That makes me feel like 10 years from now, niggas are going to look at 50 Cent. Like, 50 Cent might say, oh, nigga, look at this nigga. It's like, are you sure? They better they, not they, do that with it. Niggas know. Bro, if they do, they're doing that with everybody. They're doing that with everybody. They do that with DMX. Of course, DMX is not in the position to protect, do himself. But, like, could you imagine someone saying some shit like that in DMX in the early 2000s? Come on, bro. Definitely wouldn't. Or Ghostface. Ghost fake, like, bro, people are just like, oh, you really... He was definitely me? wanted for murder. Mm -hmm. froze up. Let's let this cook for a little bit longer. Right. Interested in our new music? Yes, Bone Thugs, we got a lot. Understand this. Understand this. We have, we are nowhere near finished. We done, we done hit so many obstacles in this motherfucking game, starting with the biggest blow of all. Soon as we got it, our first shit creeping on the come up, got hot, nigga, Easy e died the next year. So we been through some shit. And I'm proud that you niggas got 16 million a piece already. Fucking good job, nigga. Boy, he, he went. I want that shit too. Not to say He's celebrity network, it, those niggas. See, look around me. Listen, I'm, I'm all right, cool. nigga. I'm thankful. Uh... I'm happy. You washed up McKinley Benjamin's bitch. Fuck you, nigga. I ain't never washed up, nigga. Do I look old, nigga? I stored up all his knowledge. I soaked up all my mistakes. I got a big ass. I got a lot of stories to tell. And they just getting better with time, nigga. Right, I'm still hungry. Please believe that. For real? Mm -hmm. I love this shit. Music saved my life. I will never walk away from it. Because you think that I'm old. <clears throat> Fuck you if you like that. Why are you watching my shit, bitch? Yo, some of the like, media, like, internet train some of the older people. D he definitely so mad. He's, like, talking to the nigga that screen recorded this, too, which is hilarious. I don't know, man. I don't know, son. It's like, I don't know. Y'all wasn't looking at Bone Thugs and harm. Y'all, they washed up. That's what you bitch niggas wanted. No, nigga, we ain't. <clears throat> 
We done been through every record label, every situation you can possibly imagine. <clears throat> okay. Bone Thugs and Harmony is this. Lazy, crazy, busy, wishing flesh. Five niggas. We all each one-fifth of that group, which makes us a whole hundred. This right here, nigga. Five like that. Together we stand, divided we fall. So I slap your ass, nigga, that you're, all you're going to get is that. But if I punch you right where on that, where I pose to, nigga, just oh, going down, that's nigga. He, going <laughs> he definitely just, he said, you know what? I ain't going to do this no more. He said, we fighting. You know what I'm saying? He, he got to, he was, he was given the, the five, but if I punch you and then together we stand, but separated, we divided and all that shit. Listen, I'll put it this way, bro. He was making points. Yeah, he was. He was making points in there, of course. That's a fact. I don't, but I don't know what was his ultimate point, and what does he expect from the Migos? Um, I think he's just either Twenty One Savage shit, dissing his wife. That's too much. Um, I just, I mean, he's just getting his bars off, I guess. So I yeah, mean, that's right. I can't be too mad at him. Um, are the Migos going to respond? Hell to the no. Not on a about. song, at least. Definitely not on a song. They might respond. I'm just going to say anything, period. Yeah, probably not. I'm surprised 21 Savage did. 21 just be having fun, dog. It's a knife. It's a, it's a knife. It's the Month Food Podcast. Y'all put in the comment section, do you agree with Lazy? I don't even know what his ultimate point was, but do you agree with it? If you know what it was, put it in the comment section. But you know he was kicking some gems, but you know. Yeah, he was just kicking random gems, but what was yeah. his ultimate point? Was he, trying, was he trying to say he believes he beat them niggas in the battle? Was he trying to say... Was he just saying both of us wasn't washed up? Was it just was it just him just getting bar, all them bars off? Just random bars? Like, Fives. Let us know, man. Grr. Bow.